Hey, hello. It's Mother's Day weekend. Uh, I used to teach ESL, so I love this Teacher's Holiday Activity Kit book. So maybe, maybe you're not a mother, but you're like a mother, you know, to your nieces or nephews or neighbors um, and other children. Or your mother has passed, but today, tomorrow we can remember our moms and think... Thank them. Uh, Mother's Day. M Mother's Day is the second Sunday in May. So that's tomorrow. On Mother's Day, we say thank you to our mothers. Thank you, Mom. On this day, we think about all the work that mothers do. Cooking, vacuuming, holding the baby, <laughs> raising kids. We think about the love that our mothers give us. Children make cards or gifts for their mothers. They can write a thank you letter to their mothers. Dear mom, thank you for everything. Children can do their mother's work today. Their mothers can have a day to rest and have fun. So this is only two pages. Do you know these words? Find these words in the story. Draw a line under them. Copy the words. Write the meanings. Uh, mothers. Second. Second day in May. Thank you. Thank you, mothers. Think. We think about all the work that mothers do. Work. Moms work hard. Dads too. Love. We love our mothers. Uh, cards. You can send a card or gift. Present. You can write a letter. Let your mom rest and have fun. Talk about the things that a mother does for her children. Make a list. Write a letter to your mother or to the person who does those things for you. In some places, people wear carnations or flowers to show that they remember their mothers. If their mother is dead, they wear white carnations. If she is alive, they wear pink carnations. Make a gift for your mother. Uh -uh. So I need to get a pink or a white carnation to show you. Let me just draw. I think most people like roses. Here's a rose. Roses have thorns. But they are very beautiful. Here's a rose for you. And carnations are hard to describe. They are very pretty and colorful. I love carnations. I'll get one for you tomorrow. And I think the leaves are like that. So, carnation. Let's read that one more time. I'll show you an actual carnation, not my doodles. <laughs> Mother's Day is the second Sunday in May. On Mother's Day, we say thank you to our mothers. On this day, we think about all the work that mothers do. We think about the love that our mothers give us. Children make cards or gifts for their mothers. They can write a thank you letter to their mothers. Children can do their mother's work today. The mothers can have a day to rest and have fun. 